In this video, we are going to talk about the top 10 biggest vehicles ever made. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for future updates. Several of the world's largest automobiles have been commissioned by affluent Arab individuals. The United States has a strong desire for large automobiles. According to an IHS Automotive report, big automobiles accounted for more than 63% of all car sales in the United States in 2013. Large vehicles, on the other hand, accounted for only 23% of all cars sold outside of the United States. The study also discovered that full-size pickups accounted for almost 87% of all pickups sold in the United States. The United States' fascination with large automobiles may be traced all the way back to World War II. The expansion of infrastructure in the United States has also aided the appeal of larger automobiles. Another reason why Americans buy huge automobiles could be below gas prices. According to Boston.com, gas in North America is less expensive than in Europe. Even with America's fascination with large automobiles, others have pushed it to a new level. What do you do if you have more money than you know what to do with? Obviously, you order a one-of-a-kind automobile. Several of the world's largest automobiles have been commissioned by affluent Arab individuals. Many of them are absurdly large and expensive to construct. Number 10. Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan Al Nayyan's Monster Mercedes-Benz W126. The Rainbow Sheikh has unleashed another gigantic vehicle. He has two versions of the vehicle in his garage, one of which is roughly the same size as this one. The Mercedes-Benz W126 was introduced in 1979 and had a V8 turbocharged straight-six engine. It was Sheikh Hamad's favorite back in the day, so he decided to give it massive wheels. It's a long climb to the driver's seat, and this type of vehicle is only fit for a museum. According to Car Throttle, the Sheik once took the vehicle off-roading in the desert. Due to the difficulty of seeing what is beneath you while on those wheels, one would have to drive the car very slowly. Number 9. Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan Al Nayyan's Jeep Wrangler Giant Spider. This has to be the most notable of Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan's Hamad bin Hamdan alterations. It's supposed to appear like a Jeep Wrangler, but it seems more like a classic car. It's been dubbed the world's weirdest custom Jeep by Yahoo. According to Yahoo.com, the vehicle's base body was a Jeep Wrangler that was fitted into a Ford F550 frame. The front fascia, particularly the grille, is what sets it apart. It's not immediately obvious that it has anything to do with a Jeep. There's a V8 engine under the hood that can create 394 horsepower. This one appears to be the most drivable of the Sheikh's Hamad traditions. Number 8. Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan Al Nayyan's 8-Wheel Drive Nissan Patrol Sheikh Hamad is the proud owner of yet another massive automobile. The Nissan Patrol is a favorite vehicle among the Middle East's wealthy, so it's not surprising that the Rainbow Sheikh has won. On the internet, there are a few films of bespoke Nissan Patrols racing in the UAE desert. Because of its eight wheels, the car is known as the Spider. It also sports an odd-looking front fascia, which adds to the car's overall unusual appearance. Because of the shapes and eight wheels, driving the car can be a little tricky. It, along with the rest of his custom fleet, is currently on display at the Emirates Museum. Number 7. NASA Crawler This vehicle is used to transfer spaceships from the assembly site to the launch region, as its name implies. The vehicle was designed to deliver the Apollo, Saturn IB, Saturn V, and Skylab rockets, according to Wikipedia. NASA is estimated to have spent roughly $14 million on the transporter. According to Wikipedia, when it was built, the NASA Crawler Transporter was the world's largest self-powered vehicle. The Crawler is 2,721 tons in weight and has four pairs of tracks on either end. The vehicle's dimensions are 40 x 35 meters in size. The NASA Crawlers received a comprehensive overhaul in 2003, which included the addition of 16 traction motors. The vehicle can produce up to 2,750 horsepower and is powered by two 750 kilowatt-hour generators. The NASA Crawler has appeared in a number of films, including Apollo 13. Number 6. Bagger 288. 
Another mobile machine made in Germany is this one. According to Wikipedia, when the Bagger 288 was finished in 1978, it was the world's heaviest land vehicle. It weighed 13,500 tons and was thought to have cost roughly $100 million in today's currency, which would be a lot more if inflation were factored in. The Bagger 288, like the FGO, was designed with the primary goal of removing overburden from coal mines. The equipment has the capability of excavating up to 240,000 tons of coal per day. The Bagger 288 has a length of up to 220 meters. The Bagger 288, according to Wikipedia, takes 16.56 megawatts of power to run at full capacity. Number 5. Bell AZ75710. The Bell AZ75710 is a new vehicle, with manufacturing beginning in 2013. It is classified as a truck and can transport up to 450 metric tons. The Bell AZ75710 is 20.6 meters long, 8.16 meters tall, and 9.87 meters wide, according to Wikipedia. The Bell AZ75710 features two engines. Unlike other cars in its class, it has two 65-liter 16-cylinder engines with a combined output of 2,300 horsepower. When fully loaded, the automobile has a top speed of 60 km per hour and a top speed of 40 km per hour. Because of the hefty empty weight and multiple tires, there have been worries about its operational efficiency. Bell AZ, the parent business is believed to have invested more than $600 million in developing more efficient car types and increasing production capacity. Number 4. The Terex, Bucyrus RH400. Many mining sites across the world have this movable vehicle. According to Ferret.com, the RH400 has a maximum power of 3,360 kilowatts and a bucket capacity of 50 cubic meters. The Terex, Bucyrus RH400 is well known in popular culture, having appeared in the second Transformers film as Deception Demolisher. The RH400 has a 69-liter, 16 16-cylinder 16 engine that provides up to 4,500 horsepower net output. It has a fuel capacity of 4,226.8 gallons, making it a monster in the mining industry. There aren't many mining vehicles with such a large capacity. Given the vehicle's weight, the maximum travel speed is 1.4 miles per hour, which is reasonable. Number 3. Burlak. This vehicle has been dubbed the new finest Russian truck in the universe by Jalopnik. The six-wheel amphibious tractor is quite impressive. The automobile can reach almost everywhere, according to TW.com, and Russia was testing it to transport 10 researchers to the North Pole. The armored truck is 7 meters long and weighs 3 tons. It has all of the necessities for survival in the North Pole, such as a fully stocked kitchen, shower, and toilet. According to Jalopnik, the truck has propellers that allow it to float in water. The automobile hasn't been designated as a production vehicle, so estimating how much it would cost if the manufacturer decided to sell it straight to consumers would be difficult. Number 2. Sherp ATV. When you consider all of the features that come with the Sherp, it's a great value. You can get your hands on the best vehicle in the universe for $50,000, according to Jalopnik. Nothing is too difficult for the Sherp ATV to handle. It was made to plow over ice, snow, and water. You could even drive it through the desert, and it would be fine. On land, the car can reach a top speed of 27.9 miles per hour and 3.7 miles per hour on water. The tires are self-inflating, which helps the vehicle climb over barriers. The car can run on water, according to Daily Mail, since it has a system that automatically drains the water from the vehicle's body. Number 1. Mercedes-Benz G63 AMG 6x6. The Mercedes-Benz G63 AMG 66% was initially introduced in 2007 and was designed for the Austrian army. It was Mercedes's largest and second most costly vehicle at the time. With less than 20 units sold each year, mass manufacturing began in 2013 and stopped in 2015. 
The car is powered by a 5.5-liter V8 engine that can produce up to 536 horsepower. The Mercedes-Benz G63 AMG 666, according to Wikipedia, has a compressor that allows it to increase or decrease pressure depending on the terrain. The car has a top speed of 100 miles per hour and can accelerate from 0 to 60 in 7.8 seconds. To protect the vehicle's exclusivity, the business chose to phase it out in 2015. Have we missed any car? Let us know in the comment box below. Please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Thank you.